My jewelry collection has downsized a lot over the past few years ever since becoming more a minimalist and I think I have finally curated a collection that just makes me really happy. It has a lot of sentimental items, it has items that I love to use all the time and also very high quality items that are going to last me a really long time. Today I'm going to share with you my minimalist jewelry collection so I hope you guys enjoy this. If you do, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already for more videos on minimalism and simple living. I just recently added a few new pieces to my jewelry collection that I have been loving and they are by Ana Luisa and I'm actually wearing the gold hoop earrings by them and also this necklace as well. Ana Luisa is a sustainable jewelry brand. They offset 100% of their carbon emissions starting out with the sourcing of the raw materials all the way to the disposal of the pieces. The earrings that I'm wearing are the Venus Endless Gold Hoop Earrings and I absolutely love these. They're not too big, they're not too small, and lately I've just been wanting to add some gold to my jewelry collection. I like both silver and gold, so that is why I chose these beautiful gold earrings and this beautiful gold necklace as well. The necklace is called Brook Gold Horn Necklace and again it's just a piece that i wanted to add to my collection because i feel like i just had more silver jewelry than gold so i definitely wanted to start adding gold into my collection i just know these pieces are going to last me a long time they're very high quality and sustainable so if you want to check out Ana luisa i do have a discount code for you guys where you get 10 percent off your purchase on their website you will find a selection of earrings rings and necklaces and they start at $39 and range to higher end prices. So there's definitely something for anybody. Anna Luisa's jewelry comes in sustainable packaging as well. They don't use any plastic at all. And also when I got my jewelry, they came in these little cute pouches for each individual jewelry. So my earrings came in one of these. My necklace came in another one. This is my other pair of earrings by Anna Luisa. And it came in, again, this pouch and these are the Michelle earrings and they are these gold coin earrings. So if you are interested in any of these pieces that I'm wearing or just want to check out their jewelry collection, make sure you head over to analuisa.com and use my code for 10% off your entire purchase. And here is the rest of my jewelry collection. This is where I keep everything and here I hang my necklaces. On this side I have my bracelets. Down below, I just have my earrings. Here in this corner, I have sentimental necklaces that I don't really wear, but I like to keep out right there. And these are also bracelets, but they don't fit up here, so that's why they're down there. So the very first necklace is this one right here, and I actually got this a few years ago from Forever 21, and shockingly, this has not tarnished or anything like that, so I actually still wear this a lot. It's one of my favorite go-to pieces to just add to my outfit. I know that it's not the most sustainable, but I do still have this and I plan on just wearing it until I no longer can anymore or just feel like I don't want it anymore. But for now, I'm going to keep this around. This is a newer piece as well. It has one of my favorite quotes on there. It says, ah, but what if it does? It's actually from a YouTuber on here that I follow that I'm a fan of. She's not a minimalist at all, but I really like the quote and I love supporting other people here on YouTube. So bought her necklace. This necklace is a necklace that my boyfriend got me many years ago for I think an anniversary or a Christmas present but yeah I still love it. I wear it all the time and it's very simple and minimal as well and I don't know if you can tell but it is in a heart shape so I love that. This one is also another one that I got from either Forever 21 or like H&M or something like that years ago. Again, it's still in good condition and I still do like to wear it a lot and also maybe plan on decluttering it after it tarnishes and it's just not in good condition anymore, but I still wear it so I am going to keep it. This next necklace is also another present that I got from my boyfriend years ago and it's just this beautiful 
necklace with iridescent tones and diamonds down the middle. This has a very lovely story behind it. We were walking around downtown in the area that we live and we walked by this store that had this beautiful necklace hanging from the window and I just loved it so much. He actually went ahead and bought it for me and I've had it ever since so love that. This next piece I got for a Christmas present this past December from my boyfriend's mom and yeah i love it it's a tree i think it describes me perfectly because i love to be out in nature and surrounded by trees so it's very pretty i love it and this last necklace is this beautiful diamond necklace that again i got from my boyfriend years ago as a present and this actually comes with a set of earrings and a bracelet so i'll show those in a second here are the matching earrings that go with that and the bracelet is right here so again very high quality and I keep them in very good condition these two earrings I've had for a long time as well and they are my most statement bold earrings that I have and I like to keep them just when I feel like spicing up my look and it goes really nice with like a black outfit and it's just a really nice bold statement earrings that I just love to have around. Also these earrings too are more of a bold statement. They're these earrings that dangle really long and I've had these for a while as well and I just love wearing them whenever I want to feel more bougie I guess. This is a pendant from again my boyfriend and it's a pearl. I do not have the chain anymore because it broke so that's why it's just sitting around in there. And then I have these earrings right here that were actually given to me by my dad. My dad loves to give me jewelry for Christmas presents every year and so I've just started to collect them and this is a pair of them. This is another pair of them and also down here are also a couple of these earrings that my dad got for me so again very sentimental and special to me so I love them I wear them all the time I just showed you those these are just my tiny stud earrings that I keep over here because they get lost if I put them over there with all the other ones so I just put them here in the corner these earrings are silver earrings that I also got for my dad from Christmas so I keep these right over here. So as you can see, a lot of my jewelry is silver, so that's why I went with the gold for the Ana Luisa jewelry. And this bracelet over here, I actually don't wear anymore, but I just keep it as a reminder to myself that stuff doesn't really matter and also name brands or anything like that. I got this many years ago, back when I was in high school, I think, and I just wanted this bracelet because it was a dupe for the Cartier bracelet that's like three thousand dollars five thousand dollars something like that and i got this for like 25 bucks but it just makes me laugh to think about because i used to care so much about what other people had and i just wanted to fit in and be cool so i have this here sitting there because it's just a funny reminder of how i used to just try to impress people all the time even when it just came down to jewelry like this and no one really even cared and I think just one time when I was wearing it in school someone asked if it was real and I think I lied and I was like yes it's real but it's really not so yeah just a funny story with that this is another bracelet that I have again another gift from you know who <laughs> and it's actually a heart shaped lock it doesn't really lock or anything but it's just shaped as a lock in the form of a heart so really pretty again another sentimental item that I love and have been keeping for all these years so that is my necklaces my bracelets and my earrings that I currently own and in this heart-shaped box that I thrifted many many years ago has all of my rings so these are all of my rings on the left side I keep the gold ones and then on the right side I keep the silver ones. All of these have very special meaning to me. They all come from somebody that I love and care about 
and others have just some really beautiful memories attached to them so again i have narrowed down my collection so much and i'm really happy with all my rings i have narrowed down all of my jewelry collection for the past few years to this point and i can truly honestly say that i love them all so much they're all so beautiful they all mean so much to me and i just love looking at all these pieces because i know that they all mean something to me and i love to wear them as well so i don't want this video to be too long or else i'd go into detail about every single one of them unless you guys want me to i can do that in another video maybe in the future just let me know in the comments below so that is my minimalist jewelry collection i hope you guys enjoyed watching this don't forget to check out Ana Luisa and use my discount code for 10% off your purchase if you are interested in any of their pieces. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. It really supports my channel. And don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!